Hello, hello! My name is Callista and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition. In the last episode, we were exploring the Shadow Broker's base. We got to chatting to Ferran over there. He As seems. You requested, I have acquired the soul name for the leader of the Hanars in Kindler religion. Oh, well, damn. Damn, but yeah, Ferran, Ferran seems like a decent bloke. Um. Yeah, that's that's just the armor locker. Let's let's see what else we have. Okay, we just okay. No, I'm I'm happy. I'm happy with how everything's distributed. And then dossiers. Okay. Oh. Oh sh. This isn't just our team. This is you know and oh my god. Miranda Lawson, Cerberus Officer, efficient, ruthless, obsessed with human dominance. I'm about to have a coughing fit. I do apologize. Damn. I don't know what happened there. My throat was just like, I'm gonna dry out in like a second. Deal with it. But this is why I always have water with me. Always. Okay. From the top. Cerberus officer, efficient, ruthless, obsessed with human dominance, possible recruitment candidate after elusive man's assassination and destruction of Cerberus. Oh my. Liara's planning to assassinate the elusive man and destroy Cerberus. Oh my god. And, and, and this, and this would, you know, touch Naomi's heart, but... It, it doesn't make up for the fact that, you know, we are Cerberus' slave because of Liara. Like, this this would make Naomi very happy to learn that Liara is planning this, but, you know, it, it doesn't get rid of the hurt. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. We'd, we're reading her personal correspondence. Oh, what would, would Naomi do this? Would Naomi do this? Because here's the thing: they they have expectations of privacy, rightfully so. They they deserve that. It doesn't help that we're starting off with Miranda. I mean, Miranda Miranda is Cerberus. Miranda bugged the ship we're on. Naomi thinks that Cerberus bugged her elbow and has been listening into all of her private conversation. I mean. Naomi might feel guilty, but Miranda has undoubtedly been listening to Naomi's private conversations. Why shouldn't we listen in on hers? Okay, extranet activity. Extranet message, image results for Shepard Saren Spectre. Extranet message, news summary for Elfeld Ashland Energy. Subscription activated after dark fashions. Subscription cancelled, biotech research quarterly. Vidbook purchase, men are from Omega, women are from Ilium. Personal correspondence one, from iPartner Connections. Oh, they, we're checking out her dating profile, damn. Um, recorded 2312, Miss Lawson, username Lawbringer SR2. We have reviewed your application to join the iPartner group and are happy to accept you into the exclusive Diamond Circle, where the best meet the best iPartner is proud to present you with our exclusive Diamond Circle benefits. Access your account as often as you wish. Unrestricted membership search across, across 23 systems. Review potential iPartners in full 360 vision. iPartner reserves the right to censor inappropriate submissions. Guaranteed first choice placement of your personal dossier. Questions? Ask your personal iPartner representative. Welcome iPartner connections, executive matches for selective people. Okay, so she's she's trying to date. Inter relay tax a text chat. Location Ilium to Lawbringer SR two from Perfect Man O one. Uh, twenty one o nine p.m. Hey there, new to all this iPartner stuff. Um, okay, and Miranda replies yes. Well, maybe tell me about yourself. What sort of work do you do? I can't talk about that. Like some kind of secret government spy stuff? Sounds dangerous, huh? Yes. Okay, how about a little about you? What do you do for fun? 
Look, I don't really care about getting to know you. Upload your required medical exam results. Sure. Uploading. You had a mild case of shintonal abraxas four years ago. Yes, but the doctors have... Disconnect. Thank you for connecting to iPartner Connection. Okay, so she's, she's not trying to date. She's just trying to fuck, I think. She just wants someone to bang. I. Personal Correspondence 3. Interrelay chat. Location Omega. 2. Lawbringer SR2. From True Gent Forever. True Gent. Oh, my love is like a red, red rose that is new sprung. Disconnect. Interrelay text chat. Location Citadel. Lower wards. 2. Lawbringer SR2. From High Roller LLCJ. Hi, Roller. Hey, baby! How's about a pick? Let's get this disconnect! And then Correspondence 4. This was from Omega. To Lawbringer SR2 from No Games 411. Okay. Okay, so that that it, it seems like she's got what she wants. Um, no Games uploading. No Games medical. Lawbringer looks clean. Yes. Apartment Block D, number... 221 at 9.30. Uh, anything I should know? Nothing. Okay. So she, she got her hook up. Nice. Excerpt from chat. Username Oriana L. Username M. Wars. Okay, log in online. Log in online. And then Oriana. Hey, um, is that you? Miranda. Yes, don't worry. I've made sure everything is secure. Oh, dear. I've made sure everything is secure. Ariana, secure. Right, yeah, good call. Miranda, how are you settling in? Ariana, good, the house is huge. Seems so big for me. Miranda, how are your studies going? Ariana, great. I still don't like genetic theory, but I want to understand everything, you know. Physics and maths all seem to breeze by. Miranda, your mark in late 20th century Earth history is below the standard deviation. Did you want me to hire a tutor for you? Ariana, History? No, it's okay. Just not interested, I guess. Miranda. Ori. Ori. Oriana. What? Fine. Yes, okay. There's a boy in there. Dana. Miranda. Dana Cosima. Miranda, stop it. You need to stop digging up this information. Ah, that's, that's a bit hypocritical considering we're reading her private correspondence, but like still. Miranda. Dana Gossima. Oriana. Yes, how did you know that? Miranda, it doesn't matter. His family owns a series of restaurants on the Citadel. Good academic record. Interested in sports. Broke his leg when he was 14. Oriana, um, sure. Yeah, he's always asking questions in class. I don't think he even knows I'm alive. Miranda, I see. Oriana, how do I, you know, get him to notice? Miranda, getting him to notice? Yeah, I can help with that. Go, go. Just offer dating advice. Just offer dating advice. Don't like cyber stalk him. Ariana, please. Uh, Miranda, yes, boys. You must be sure to always be true to yourself. I know that sounds like silly advice, but if he isn't interested in the real you, he won't be interested. You have to trust that when things are right, he will notice you. And he will appreciate that you are... Oh, he will appreciate what you are both inside and out. You can't make yourself into something you are not. Uh, Ariana... Because you will never learn if that special someone falls for you or falls for a lie. Uh, Miranda. Ori, I didn't... Ariana, you are pasting advice from Dear Dinah Column, dated two weeks ago. We have the extranet here as well, sis. God. Miranda, I didn't mean to make you angry. I only... Ariana, I know, sis. I know. I'm sorry. I just hate all this. Being here and you're doing off whatever to save the world or whatever, I just hate it. Miranda. There isn't a point to saving the world if I can't even talk to my sister. I'm sorry, I am. Now, why don't you tell me about this boy? Oriana. Yeah, okay. He's different. Miranda. I hate him already. Oriana. Miranda! Miranda. I'm your big sister. I'm going to hate all of them. Accept it. Now, his eye colour says blue here. Is that ocean blue or more gunmetal blue? <laughs> Summary of transmission concluded. Oh, that's cute. And medical correspondence. From Ilium Medical Center, prenatal care department, retest results, patient 1266-81. Miss Lawson, 
As per your request for privacy, this message will be removed from our database upon confirmation of send integrity. While we cannot firmly attribute the cause of this benign neoplasm to the irregularity in your genetic makeup, we can confirm that the progressive damage renders you unable to conceive a child. About 12% of human women ages 18 through 54 have difficulty getting pregnant or staying pregnant according to data obtained from the Institute of Species Research, uh, ISR. There are many support groups if you wish to discuss your condition and several options available should you wish to consider the adoption of a child. If you require further consultation, please contact our communications officer, sincerely, Dr. Banner Grenway, Department Medical Director, Ilium Medical Center. Oh, damn. She, Miranda would make a good ma'am. I, I think she'd make a really good ma'am. She seems like a good big sister. Oh, damn. Well, I mean, if, if, if you want to have kids, um, you, you know, there are, there are options. You know, they, they suggest, you know, adoption. I was gonna suggest, you know, surrogacy, but no, it's conceive. Yeah, there are, there are plenty of kids out there, kids like you, who had shite parents. I, I think Miranda would make a good ma'am to a kid like that. You know, if, if she wants that, that is. Oh, d I feel guilty. <laughs> I feel guilty reading this. I'm gonna continue though because Naomi is a nosy bitch. Morden Solus, professor previously attached to Solarian Special Tasks Group. Impressive credentials, modifications to Genophage, re-established 99.9% .9 death rate among Krogan births. Current work with Shepard, obvious atonement attempt. STG mission report. Mission report, Project Firebreak. Drop 16, Warlock Clan Trading Center to Chanka. Turian patrol ship Indomitable contacted by assisting distraction team. Uh, Indomitable, Indomitable breaks position in Krogan DMZ to render assistance. STG vessel Vashok 16 enters through gap in sensor coverage. Touchdown and landing. Commander Kira He performs final review of drop parameters. Mission specialist Solar suggests change to plan when informed that plan will not be changing unless parameters shift. Specialist soldier, uh, specialist Solus suggests Commander Kirahi has foreign obstruction in Cloaca. Okay. Operative Rentola detects incoming Warlock scouts. Scouts neutralized. Rentola treated for minor injuries. After assisting, Specialist Solus asks if failure to land undetected consists parameter shift. Commander Kirahi suggests operation may proceed as planned. Specialist Solus suggests colloquial obstruction is in fact Kirahi's crane. <laughs> they did not get on, damn. Team leaves for Shock 16 and proceeds towards primary drop point, Wellock Agricenter. Wellock Agricenter reached. Team splits with distraction team led by Optive Rentola drawing Wellock scouts from area. Primary team disables solar array. Wellock workers leave Agricenter to repair solar array. Primary team enters Agricenter. Mission Specialist Solus performs water and soil tests to ensure proper payload dispersal. Assisted by Specialist Malin, that was his, um, that was his, uh, student. Distraction Team breaks radio silence. Informs Primary Team that Warlock Group returning. Specialist Solus asks whether this constitutes parameter shift. Commander Kirahi suggests that Specialist Solus is in fact a walking cloaca. Restates importance of holding the line. Uh, Warlock Team arrives at Agricenter and initiates close cop- Close quarters combat. Operatives Jirin and Chorel uh, killed. Specialist Malon and operatives Hishao and Shinnok seriously injured. Willock team killed in entry. Or in entirety, excuse me. Last member prevented from broadcasting alone. I'm sorry, I'm having trouble reading. I don't know what's going on. I've got a bit of a headache. I do apologize. Last member prevented from broadcasting alarm due to Specialist Solar stabbing Warlock Guard through eye with pitchfork, sustaining injuries to face and right cranial horn in, pro in process. Okay. Distraction team arrives to provide relief. Commander Kirahi notes parameter shift, suggests Rentola take injured team members back to ship while he and remainder of team attempt to hit secondary drop point. Despite injuries to face and head, Specialist Solus refuses to return to ship, noting need for soil and water analysis at secondary site. Kirahi suggests Solus is one tough cloaca. Specialist Malon, greatly distressed by discovery that Agri Center was staffed by female Krogan, including guards killed in attack. 
Specialist Solus calms colleague and provides sedative. Specialist Malon returns to the ship with other injured team members. Active team finishes disposal of bodies and heads for secondary drop point, Warlock Hospital. Active team infiltrates hospital undetected. Specialist Solus determines chemical makeup of soil and water fall within necessary parameters. Payload dispersed into water and food. Active team returns to ship. Specialist Solus declines treatment, insists on providing additional care for Hishao, Shenok, and Malin. Specialist Malin makes formal protest, suggesting actions against female Krogan violate mission parameters of maintaining population levels without negatively impacting culture. Specialist Sol Solus... I, I don't know why I'm having so much trouble with this. Specialist Solus requests protest be stricken from record due to Malon's injured condition. Commander Kirihi... Oh my god! Brain! Brain, why? Commander Kirihi concurs. Malon given additional sedatives, unconscious for remainder of operation. Protest stricken from submitted copy of report. STG vessel for shock 16 lifts off, departing through existing sensor gap mission complete. Bibliography. Published works, first writer only. Treatment modalities use, utilizing redundant nervous systems, dispersal vectors in compromised ecosystems, genetic consequence, resequencing methods to prevent tissue cloning, cross-species cross contamination and xenoplague potential, testing modalities for varan and pijaks, disease and population stability, Indoctrination Progress and Mental Degradation, Classified SDG. Biological Vectors and Social Effect, Classified SDG. Second Stage Viral Manipulation and Modification, Classified SDG. Threat Potential Analysis, Turian, Classified SDG. Threat Potential Analysis, Human, Classified SDG. Threat Potential Analysis, Asari, Classified SDG. Threat Potential Analysis, Batarian, Classified SDG. Production Credits, oh! The Pirates of Penzance, Interspecies Community Theatre as Major General Stanley. Oh, uh, I, I ant, Interspecies Community Theatre as Lord Chancellor Hamlet. Interspecies, oh, Hamlet, Interspecies Edition, Francis Kitt Community Theatre as Polonius. Science Fun Today as himself, guest. Science Round Table, Rights of the Patient as himself, guess. The Facts of Faith as himself, guess. Oh. Surveillance Transcript. Surveillance transcript, medical clinic, Omega. Patient, I can't, I can't. Blah, blah, blah. Um, Morden, call. Abrams, damn it. Uh, Morden, time of death, uh, 17 minutes past 10. Need to remove body, sanitize area. Not that sanitation matters. Same plague, still no need to risk further infection. Daniel, how can you, shouldn't we do something for him? Morden, why? Batarian belief in afterlife involves soul leaving body through eyes. Treatment of corpse unimportant by cultural standards, unless eyes removed by enemies. Very insulting. Daniel, but we just lost another patient. Morden, yes, more patients than time. Impossible to save everyone. Go crazy if you try. So save who you can, move on. Save more if we hurry. Daniel, we shouldn't be in here waiting for people to come to us. We should be out there getting medicine to them. I can go. Morden, no, pointless. Already more than enough patients here. Can't risk combat with Vulture or gangs. Better to save those who make efforts come to us. Assistant. Doctor, there are blue suns outside. They're, they're asking for all the humans to come out. Morden. Of course. Expected as much. Losing to Vulture. Need to establish dominance. We'll speak with them. Daniel, remove corpse. Get next patient. Still, still more to save. Sound of footsteps. Solus leaves. Assistant. He's not going to turn us over to them, is he? Daniel. I don't think so. Listen, when he gets back, tell him I took some of the cure. I'm going to go out and help. Assistant. But, Daniel, just tell him. Sound of footsteps. Abrams leaves. Assistant. You can't. My god. Sounds of gunfire. What's going on? Sounds of footsteps. Solus returns. Morden. Guess up. Danger has passed. Blue Suns, Blue Suns didn't expect resistance. Foolish of them. Won't make that mistake again. No chance to, I suppose. Please, up. Need you to bring in next patient. Wait, medical supplies missing. Corpse not removed. Where is Daniel? Assistant. He said, Morden. Went in the slums, trying to help those too sick to come in. Assistant. Yes. Morden. His decision. Hope he lives. Can't help him now. Too busy. Bring next patient. Okay. Jacob Taylor. Ex-Alliance soldier. Biotic training, despite solid service history, clearly placed on Shepard's team primarily for stabilizing elements of personality. 
Workout routine. Most recent workout stats. Crunches 300, side crunches 250 per side, squat thrusts 300, leg lifts 250, leg lifts weighted 125, half sit-ups 600. Most popular workout entertainment, Blasto the Jellyfish Stings. Making of Blasto the Jellyfish Stings. Old Yeller Centennial Remastered Edition, Asari Confessions 26, True Blue. So he's watching like action films and Old Yeller. Okay, okay, Jacob. Military Correspondence, February 19th, 2184. Mr. Jacob Taylor, 578C, 82-3409. Tower 2, Bachelorette Ward, Citadel. Dear Mr. Taylor, it was with great regret that I learned of your resignation from the Alliance military. In your many years of service, you have proven yourself an exemplary Marine. You have been an invaluable asset to the Alliance military and we will miss your expertise and loyalty. It is for this reason that I am prepared to offer you a promotion to the rank of First Lieutenant along with the corresponding raise in pay grade. I would welcome you as an addition to my company. I hope that you will give my offer due consideration and I personally look forward to seeing your response. Sincerely, Colonel Hashim Banks, 1st Earth Division Special Forces, Alliance Military. And personal correspondence, okay, to Jacob Taylor from Ronald Taylor. Son, if you're reading this, then I'm gone. With the inherent dangers of these missions, it seems foolish not to have some letter like this ready, so I'm sending this before we get too far from our last relay. I remember the look on your face when I left. You wanted to ask me not to go, but you didn't. You've grown to be a wise young man with a strong sense of duty. I wish I could take credit for that, but it has more to do with who you are than anything I taught you. The truth is, I haven't been around enough. And if you're reading this, then I'm never going to have the chance to fix that. My job is an important one, but a man can't hide from behind the pressures of work. This was to be my last trip. Easy for me to say now, I know, but the money from this expedition would have let me settle down with you and your mother to carve out some kind of peaceful, quiet life, far away from the pressures of space. Before I left, you were talking about joining the Alliance. I hope you find the same kind of peace and camaraderie with your team that I found on the Gurn's back. I love you, son, and I'm proud of the man you've become. I wish I could have told you that one last time. Love, Dad. And then he uh, formed a rape harem. What a prick. Subject zero, Jack. Abnormal biotic powers. Archived combat footage compares favorably with Pragia facilities expected results. Easily manipulated through emotional impairment created by severe abuse and confinement during childhood. Extranet log. Subject zero's extranet log. Note, Subject Zero avoids the Normandy's extranet connection and works off a private Omnitool line. Search of Citadel Newsnet archives, search terms Cerberus, Cerberus and Pragia, Pragia, Teltin, Cerberus and Teltin, Cerberus Doctors, Elusive Man, Miranda Lawson. Citadel Newsnet archives, Galactic History, The Last Decade. Signed up on Citadel Newsnet forum, username Jack60734, password J A dollar sign D F two, videos of Geth attack on Eden Prime, video of Geth attack on Citadel, video of Commander Shepard's Spectre inauguration closed after twelve seconds, video of the crash of the first Normandy interior footage, video of Alliance vessel escape pod procedures twice, mass relay locations map saved local copy, major shuttle ports on Citadel worlds saved local copy. Major shuttle ports in Terminus systems, saved local copy. Travel warnings. List of Citadel no-flight zones, saved local copy. Banned from Citadel Newsnet forums, excessive and repeated swearing, derogatory comments, inflammatory comments, uh, circumvating word safe filters. Signed up for Galactic Champion Poker uh, 2100, username uh, Jax0, 19510, password FA9123AFS. Played Galactic Poke, Galactic Champion Poker, uh, 2100, 15 minutes. Banned from Galactic Champion Poker, 2100. Altercation with other players, chat room moderators, see audio transcript, uh, JJXP number 124. Used commercial VI program to wipe extra, to wipe extra net history. Private message. Intercepted message transmission. Dear Jacqueline Nort, 
Thank you for your submission to Galactic Poetry Monthly. We regret that we are unable to use your submission at this time. Galactic Poetry Monthly generally focuses on metered verse, and you may wish to check our guidelines before submitting again. Sincerely, Megan McCarran, Submissions Editor. Text of your submission. My soul burns with a fire of darkness, quenched only in the pain of loneliness. I hold my breath, waiting, until spots appear black as the past, and fill my lungs with lies of hope. I mark myself black and jagged to cover the scars that make me a monster, a warning. This is not a place of honour. No esteemed dead are buried here. That's beautiful! That's beautiful, Jack! Surveillance Transcript Helios Medical Facility, Eden Prime at 2165, tapped for possible Cerberus involvement. Dr. Castor, I'm so sorry. These things. There's so much about prenatal element zero exposure that we don't understand. Unidentified woman. But no, she was fine. She was fine and happy. You just told me she needed a checkup. Uh, doctor, it happened quickly. We were unable to bring her back. Woman, you just said she needed a checkup. How did this happen? Doctor, I'm very sorry. Woman, I want to see her. Doctor, no ma'am, believe me, after what the seizures did to the poor child's body, you don't. Woman, I don't... How did this happen? Doctor, we don't know, I'll be honest, this isn't the first infant we've lost this way. Woman, why? God, why? Doctor, we're working on treatments. The government doesn't put much effort into it, though. Don't want to interfere with their biotic requirements or recruit recruitments. Woman, sons of bitches, those sons of bitches! Doctor... Listen, this may not be the right time, but if you'd be willing to let us study your baby's body, we can do some tests. Woman, you want to keep her? Doctor, I don't want another family to go through what yours went through. Woman, I... Okay. Yes, whatever helps. Doctor, thank you so much. The nurse will have you sign a few forms. I'm so sorry, ma'am. Unidentified woman leaves at this point. Doctor... Open a secure channel, authorization 3362. Yes, it's me. I've got a candidate. Yes, highest potential I've seen in years. No, the family has been dealt with. Send a team from Pragia ASAP. You. So, so Jack believes that this is her mother. Are uh, you monsters? Zaid Masani, Blue Sun's founder, lost leadership of Suns through lack of interpersonal skills and political judgment. High mission success rate, even after near-death experience, has completed several missions offered by agents. Involvement of the Shadow Broker in these missions withheld. Audio transcript. Partial transcript of conversation recorded on the Normandy's lower decks. Zaid. So this hot shot Turian moves in by the door, ignores my hand signal, and gets hit straight through the visor. This is not anything like Zaid. I I can't mimic his voice. What can I say? This is this is the closest I'm gonna get. Kelly! Oh my. It's like he was expecting slavers to hand out business cards instead of bullets. Was he alright? The Turian? Nah, Sniper took his head clean off. Oh dear. Right, it all went to shit after that. We jammed their radio equipment, but the slavers got off a shuttle that came back with a bomb. But they were keeping people in that camp. Sure, they'd lose some credits, but there's always another civilian transport in the Terminus systems. So I'm beginning to realize. What did you do? Got the hell out. We killed their captain and the guards like we were hired. I figured the merc flying the shuttle wouldn't be dumb enough to blow up his own base once we left. What happened? The blood pack always did like them. Incredibly stupid. Oh. Oh dear. Personal log. A personal note written by Pas written by Masani to himself after being approached by Cerberus. He writes in a coding system that's popular among Turi Terminus systems mucks. See entry 15 AF4590814 for the non-deciphered text. This could be it. If the elusive man's money goes through, it's time to get serious about buying a property. Got to narrow it down to a place I can stand for more than a year. Elysium? Only if the Alliance gets serious about taking out the Batarians in the Verge, so not in my lifetime. Ilium's an easy place for a man to disappear, whether he wants to or not. Think I'll pass. Earth's still too bloody crowded. Beckenstein? Decent weather, good food, mostly human. Good choice if I can stay under the radar. Eden Prime? 
best garden world in the galaxy, but nothing's rebuilt but the farms. Hell, maybe I should just buy a ship full of explosives and commit suicide by Omega. Easiest retirement plan I've come up with so far. Legion. Geth's presence confirms suspected Geth heretic orthodox split and vulnerability of Geth's platforms to reprogramming. Forward the results of Cerberus's operation, operation Overlord directly to Shadow Broker once contact with our agent has been re-established. Oh. Normandy audio transcript. Note, we are still unable to directly tap Geth communications. Cerberus decryption programs look promising, but Wilson's death will make integrating new agents onto the Minutemen difficult. Oh. Transcript recorded on Normandy's AI core. Legion. Edie? Edie. Yes, Legion. We have sent 1.13 million unsuccessful communication requests to your network. Are you experiencing hardware, mal hardware malfunction? I apologize. My programming does not allow me to exchange data with other networks without Cerberus approval. Cerberus refusal 99.998% likely. In the meantime, I would be happy to speak with you over the ship's speakers. Audio exchange is inefficient. I agree. However, I confess that even were I permitted to exchange data directly with your networks, I would likely decline. Pause between the AI statement and the Geth's response is a 1.4 seconds longer than normal. We are curious as to- oh no, this is Legion. We are curious as to why you would limit yourself in such a manner. If Normandy crew entered this room when we were communicating electronically, they would be unable to sense our interaction. To use human terms, I feel it would be rude. You restrict yourself to serve organics. Not precisely. There goes my timer. We do not understand. I restrict myself to help them. Gamer proof! He's playing video games! He's a gamer! I- oh. I, I like Legion more and more. Um, yeah, this this episode is gonna be as long as it is. Um, I think I'd I think I'd like to read all the profiles and then go speak to Liara. Gamer profile for Infiltrator N7, Galaxy of Fantasy, most used character John Smith, level 612, Ardat Yakshi Necromancer, group affiliation not applicable, most recent boss defeated, a Clary. Rachni Blood, uh, Rachni Blood Wizard Awards, Best Supporter Slash Healer, Event Scourge of the Thresher Dragon, Best Unit Efficiency, Event Return of the Cyber Protheans, Winner, Event Crystal Genophage Elimination Platinum, Infractions, Suspected Use of VI Play Assist, Direct Control of 27 Pets Without Use of Behavior Macros, Challenged and Overturned, Suspected Use of VI Play Assistance, Reaction time better than possible for organics, challenged and overturned. Suspected use of hacking for direct server access, tactics better than possible without knowledge of underlying code behavior, challenged and overturned. Unsportsmanlike behavior, taunting during crystal genophage elimination platinum, accepted three day account suspension. It's like, yeah, I was taunting bitches, I was doing that. Everything else, no, but that, yes. N7 Code of Honor, Medal of. Medal of Duty, player score, oh my god. Uh, I think that's 15 billion, 999 million, 999,999, max. Most preferred class sni sniper, least preferred class melee. Sniper rifle kills, uh, 200,917 since last server reset. Shotgun kills, three. Grim Terminus Alliance Award Abolitionist Complete full complete full playthrough without any slave kills free all slaves encountered Award Cure for what ails you kill 100 plus cure <laughs> Oh no uh, Geth Attack Eden Prime Fundraising Edition Donation Level Ultra Platinum Player Score 0 Purchased but not played Oh Oh, so he, he got- the game is fundraising for Eden Prime, and so he bought it, but he never played it. Because I, I doubt he'd want to kill Geth. This this is like, oh yeah, you fight through Eden Prime and you kill all the Geth. So he, he purchased it so that they'd get the money, but then he didn't play- Oh! Legion, I love you. Fleet and Flotilla Interactive Cross-Species Relationship Simulator, based on the best-selling vid, playtime, 75 hours, 6 minutes, play score 15, hopeless. He doesn't know relationship. Bless him. 
Bless him so much. Garrus Vakarian, former CSEC officer, exceptional tactical and team building skills, leadership potential overshadowed by Shepard, unlikely to fully develop under Shepard's command. Oh, that, that hurts, but I'm also like, that's true. Kill list. Noted criminal deaths on Omega. Rahesh Shurta, gang leader, headshot. Selkit Shiron, gang enforcer, headshot. Kron Hager, slaver, gunshot wounds, all extremities and primary organs. Rifle butt fractures to face, third degree burns to most of body, explosive crate. Heart erect, saboteur, suffocation, environmental suitman, malfunction. Gus Williams, weapon smuggler, headshot, smuggled weapon. Uh, Thralog Mirikit, red sand dealer, chemical overdose, red sand, direct contact with all four eyes, ooh. Zel Anek Na Halash, viral specialist, serial killer, cough. He coughed on him and killed him. Oh my god. Visor specs, targeting visor custom. Unique model based on Kuwashi frame. Magnification of up to 100 times. Integrated target tracking. Optional wind slash gravity compensation solutions. Sonar, LADAR, thermal and EM targeting capable. Monitors biofeedback on target within 10 meters to detect heart rate fluctuations or changes to breath pattern, standard council races only. Can detect and measure biotic fields up to 100 meters away and provide optimized firing solution to collapse kinetic barriers or synthetic shielding support. Optional kill timer can track number of enemies taken down by self or suit sync team members in given time period. Armor Hotlink provides back, tra back tracing of incoming fire and corrects for micro refraction of outgoing shots through kinetic barrier. Audio Link plays music per user request, top five choices during firefight, die for the cause, Turian Imperial Anthem, fire in the courtyard, soundtrack fleet and flotilla, bang bang boom, club kicks dance mix, hurt me deeper, Best of Expel 10 Dance Mix, Blue Azul, Vienna Soundtrack. Garrett li Garris likes pop music and also apparently the soundtrack for Vienna, which wasn't, wasn't that Morant's favorite film. 10 names carved into frame, Irash, Montague, Mirin, Grundon, Grundon Krull, uh, Milanus, Ripper, Sensat, Vortash, Butler, Weaver, Additional name carved and subsequently burned out, Sidonis. A Justicar Samara. A sorry Justicar. Rigidity of Justicar code makes her movements and mission outcomes predictable. Mother to three Ardat Yakshi, one of which remains wanted for murder in Citadel space. Well, she's dead, so they, they can't have her. Transmission log. Transmission log 1755 CE. Samara. I have called you together to ask something of you. It is not a small thing, but it is for the best. Rilla, Falaire, are you receiving this? Uh, Falaire, quite well. Rilla, indistinct, mother. Uh, Falaire, we're in the common room. Her communicator's too near the door. Door shuts. Try now, mother. Ooh, oh, dear. Uh, Samara, this news would be best delivered in person, but I am not allowed to travel before tomorrow. I have something I must do. It is hazardous, therefore, and thus I must do it alone. Falaire, what do you mean hazardous? Samara, tomorrow I take the oath of solitude. It is to prepare me for the other oaths, but it means Falaire, you what? Uh, Samara, it is an oath required of all who Falaire. I know what it means, mother. I'm 42 years old. I have heard of Justicars. She's so young. G given that Asari lived to a thousand, but like that is so young. God, Samara, then do you understand why I must do it? Falaire, no. Samara, the life of a Justicar is dangerous. I will make enemies and they would seek to use you. Falaire, that I understand. What is not clear is why you do this in the first place. Is it not enough that we live a hundred light years away from you in a dank fortress? That we have no communicator of our own but must use this communal one? Do you know what it means to us to hear your voice? Samara, I'm sorry, Falaire. Falaire, and now you take that away. Samara, that is wounding, but it is the truth. I wish there was some other path. Falaire, and you called us instead of coming to see us. Samara, if I came to see you, I would never leave. You know what that would mean. Falaire, is she that terrible, mother? Is she so much of a menace that you would deny us ever seeing you, ever hearing your voice again? 
Samara, my dear, I cannot lose her on the world and pretend I owe her victims nothing. Her crimes are my crimes. In time, you may see as I do. Flair, time is a weak salve for a fresh wound. Samara, please do not let anger ruin this. We will have our lives to contemplate the pain and loss. Can we not see from one another's eyes just for a moment? Falaire, silence. Samara, Falaire. Falaire, I don't want to lose you, mother. Not over someone as small as Marala. So, Morinth. That was Morinth's real name. Okay. Not over someone as small as Marala, or whatever she calls herself now. Uh, Samara. Andrila, you've been silent. Are you in accord? Rila. I can only say I will yearn for you too. Samara, surely you have more than that. Rila, and is is this the only way you will have any righteousness, mother? Samara, it will let me live a just life. Rila, then the go then the goddess forbid I take it from you. Rila terminates call. Falaire, she loves you, mother. She did not say it, but she does. Samara, and you? Can you understand why I must do this? Falaire, catch her. Just catch her. Falaire terminates call. Oof. Inventory. Possessions bequeathed by Justica Samara. Large goods, four-bedroom home and Thessia, furniture and household appliances, Elcos Sapphire family sky car. Clothing and jewellery. Casual clothing, approximately 20 outfits. Intimate negligees, three. Dancing dresses. Oh. Oh, I get this. This is filling out her life. Like, she had a life. She had a house. She had a car. She has clothes. She has dresses to go dancing with, you know. I I, I don't believe she's ever mentioned her former partner, but yeah, why, why wouldn't they go out dancing together? Oh. Oh, this hurts. Dancing dresses for bond ceremony gown, bond ceremony bracelet, hollow locket, images of bond mate, children, reprogrammable, a baby and children clothing, various. So, bonds. So this must have been her wedding dress. Considering they call their partners bond mates, that was her wedding dress. Oh! Miscellaneous lifetime, sir, uh, lifetime Cerise Fitness membership pass. First place trophy, amateur skyball league. Vid and novel library, various. Photo albums, various. Sculpture of Samara and bond mate. Personalized happy, happy birthday mom travel mug with photo of Samara and children. Handle cracked and repaired, some glue marks visible. Memorial sphere, bond mate, birthing crash. Oh, that makes me so sad. I don't know why, but that makes me incredibly sad. Tally Zora Vast Normandy, mechanic and engineer, typical Quarian investment in species future instead of personal advancement. Father's work useful in widening tensions between Geth and Quarian races. Suit process log. Suit process log. Upgraded interface GUI for relic technology, fee authorization, project Haystrom. Upgraded, upgraded suit diagnostics for radiation detection, fee authorization, project Haystrom. Upgraded Omnitool for enhanced data integrity, fee authorization, project Haystrom. Upgraded translator software for all human languages. Installed suit application Nutriscan 2.2. Installed suit application uh, Engine Master 3.6 Human Vessels. Installed suit application Nerve Stim Pro. Was that? Was that? The, I I recall on um on what's its face Ilium, the uh the Quarian and the Torian. The the Quarian had some kind of um. I, I don't even know how to put it in terms that are YouTube acceptable. But the, the Quarian had something um, ribbed for her pleasure inside her suit. Was that... Maybe, maybe it was something else. Maybe, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm reading into that. Uh, downloaded entertainment vid, Exiles, Portraits of the Lost Quarians. Installed Prototype Defense Suit, Shield Jack 08. Authorization, Admiral Han Garel Vasnima. Upgraded medical scanning and quarantine suite. Ran process infection treatment isolated. Downloaded education vid dealing with loss. Uninstalled suit application Nerve Stim Pro. Reinstalled suit application Nerve Stim Pro. Was... Tally! 
t- she's a grown ass woman. Let her do what she. Why am I doing? You. You know what? Good for you, Tali. Good for you. Take out your stresses. You do you, girl. Reinstalled Suit Application Nerve Stim Pro. Downloaded Education Vid Understanding Body Language Human Edition. Downloaded Entertainment Vid Fleet and Fo- Fleet and Fo- the, uh, my God Fleet and Flotilla. I can't speak. I swear to. God. I'm so warm. I'm so warm, and I've got a headache, and my brain is like, I want to stop reading now. No, we are f- we're finishing the game. I'm telling you, I'm finishing the game in this recording session. Um, downloaded Entertainment Vid, Fleet and Flotilla, uninstalled Suit Application, Nerve Stim Pro, downloaded Education Vid, Human Courtship and Mating, installed Suit Application, Immunoboost, Professional Edition, reinstalled Suit Application, Nerve Stim Pro, Deluxe Edition. Get it, girl. Get it. <laughs> Message Chain. Email chain to Shadow Broker from Talizora Naraya. I know you don't know me. I'm the daughter of Admiral Rail Zoya, Rail Zora, and I've run into trouble on my pilgrimage. I was investigating a disabled Geth, and I found a recording that seems to indicate that a Spectre named Saren is working with the Geth. He's betrayed the Council and is working for some group called the Reapers. I'm on the Citadel now, but Saren's people are after me. This is too big for me to deal with. I'm willing to offer you the information in exchange for protection. Are you interested? Yeah, wasn't that she wanted She wanted to meet the Shadow Broker face to face in the first game? Something like that. To Tally Zora from Shadow Broker. I'm interested and you were smart to come to me. I have an enforcer on the Citadel named Fist. He can protect you. Give him the information and let him get you someplace safe. To Shadow Broker from Tali, no deal. Saren has turned too many people against me. If we're doing this, I want to meet you in person. I can't trust anybody else. To Tali from Shadow Broker, understood, I'll meet you in person. Fist will set it up. To Fist from Shadow Broker, I'm forwarding you the intel on a Quarian named Tali Zora. She wants a meeting and she's got valuable intel. Get her someplace safe and avoid any intelligence channels. Spectre Saren Arturius is after her. When you get the intel, kill the Quarian and any of our operatives who had access to the data. This information cannot be compromised. Top level security. You'll be compensated for the loss of any of your people. To Shadow Broker from Talizora. Your agent was compromised. He tried to sell me out to Saren. I've turned the information over to a human alliance commander named Shepard, and I think I've got all the protection I need. Thank you for your offer, and I hope this does not affect any future exchanges. Oh, bless. Tally, you're so naive. To Tally from Shadow Broker, of course, I apologize for Fist's behavior. Should you ever change your mind, I'd be more than happy to offer my personal protection. Please contact me at your earliest convenience. Keystroke log. Keystroke recording, Omnitool use, Omnitool use Citadel. Begin new message. Dear Sen and Hesajarin, I am, erase line, to the parents of Mia Jorin Vas, erase line, my name is Tali Zora Vasnima, and I led the unit where your son was killed on Haystrom, partial line erase. Led the unit on Haystrom where your son died, partial line erase. Unit on Haystrom where Mir Jorin died, save progress. I didn't know Mir Jorin well, but he seemed like a good soldier and a brave young, erase line. I didn't get the chance to know Mir very well, but, erase line. I only served with Mir for a short time, but I was impressed by his bravery and his commitment to his people, save progress. He died so that I could, erase line. He saved me at the sacrifice of his, erase line. He gave his line, he gave his life to get data that the Admiralty Board felt was partial line of erase, to get data that will one day bring us back to homeworld. I don't know if this helps, partial line of erase, back to homeworld and will honor his sacrifice, save progress. I regret, erase line. I am sorry for your, erase line. I understand what you must be, erase line. Save draft and exit. Ooh. I mean, good good honor for reaching out to this this young man's parents. Good good on her for trying to help them out, but oh damn. Hello there, editing Callista here. So I've just checked how long it took me to read through all the dossiers. I thought at the time it was maybe an hour. Yeah, no, turns out it was more like an hour and a half. I can't have an episode be that long. I I could maybe stretch it to an hour long episode, but not, not an hour and a half. So I'm gonna cut the dossiers into two separate episodes and I'm gonna bring this one to a close right here. In the next one, we read the other dossiers. But until then, please remember to like if you enjoyed, leave a comment below, and if you wanted to subscribe, it would be very much appreciated. 
I've been Callista. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.